Hello, my name is Bradley Namello, and I am going to show you how to record in 3D on 3DS Max 2012. Um, I'm just going to start playing this right now. First thing you're going to want to do is create a camera, just one for now. Uh, don't position it like I did right here. Uh, I just did it all weird because I don't know. But um, I'm just going to, that's like the left image and then you're gonna have the right image here on the top right wireframe what you're gonna want to do is duplicate the cameras and then you have two different cameras and one at the top uh, left viewport and one in the top right so what you want to do is you're gonna want to position them well like pretty close together so it kind of simulates eyesight and then you have two so then you, you're gonna want to group them just name it whatever the hell you want, the uh, 3D camera. Um, then you have your 3D camera, so uh, then you're just going to want to position it pretty well. Uh, any really way doesn't really matter. Um, you can, uh, I'm going to render it pretty soon, just, just test it out. Uh, I'm just, I'm not going to do a full animation right now, I'm just going to do a single snapshot. So what you're going to want to do is render the left camera, like, just click the left viewport, top left viewport, and then render it. So then you have that, and then soon you'll get your, once that is done, you're going to want to save it. I don't know when this is going to end. Uh, rendering, 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 rendering. Well, once you get this image, you're gonna want to save it like left, and then just save it as a JPEG. Blah 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 blah. Then you're gonna click the right one, and then you can save that too. I just skipped ahead because I don't feel like putting the render times in this, it's making you wait. Okay, now you have two of your images. So it's supposed to simulate left eye and right eye. So I'm just going to put it in an anaglyph creator just to sh show you what it would look like if you did it in a uh, video, uh, yeah, video editor. Mm, let me find it. Let me find it. Let me find it. 3D channel. Okay, left. Now right. Don't mess with this. Create. Takes quite a bit. Okay, now you have your image, but you can visually see that it's kind of uh, separated, like spaced out a bit. So what I'm going to want to do is uh, go back and put the cameras closer together because it's crap when you can't really test it. Well, I don't have my 3D glasses, so I can't really test it. I don't know if that was good enough, but I just decided to put them closer just so, yeah. So... It's more desirable, desirable, blah, you know what I meant, but, uh, okay, now you have the images again, blah, 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 mm, okay, now you have it again, uh, okay, left, JPEG, JPEG, save, yes, okay, now, you're going to want to redo it, but, uh, left, okay, now you have your image, which, uh, you can tell it's a lot better if you were to put on 3D glasses, I believe it would work, I'm not sure, because I don't have mine on them, um, yeah, so I'm trying to figure out when I'm getting my 3D glasses, but soon, I hope, and then, yeah, so now, basically what you did with this, except you want to render a uh, 3D video, like render an animation of the left eye and an animation of the right eye. Then you're going to want to upload them both to YouTube as unlisted, I believe. I'm trying to find the editor, but I can't find it. It's on YouTube Home. You scroll all the way down. I don't know if there's any other easy way to do this, but you click try something new. 
scroll down to 3D Video Creator. Try it out. And then you have a thing at the bottom that says left and right. You're going to want to drag those two clips that you have unlisted into there. And then you click play. It should show it. You don't really need to fix time sync or vertical alignment. And what you're going to want to do. I don't have any other videos to test it out on. But uh, it should show you. Like it would turn out like this. Basically. Because I already did that once. And then because it's not the same image it didn't really work so then you're going to want to name your video publish it and then make that one like public or and then you could delete the two clips you uploaded like the left and the right eye and that's basically it I believe uh yeah rate comment subscribe uh hope that helps